Hello friends, today we will learn about one more natural resource, soil. Air, water and soil are the gifts of nature to man. Soil is needed to grow plants. In this lesson, we shall study about soils, their formation, types, where they are found in different parts of India, conservation of soil and its importance. What is soil? The upper layer of our earth in which plants grow is called soil. The soil types and thickness varies from place to place. The rocks break down due to variations in temperature, wind and water. This process is called weathering. Soil is formed by this process. It takes hundreds of years to form a soil layer of a few inches. Do you know? Formation of soil depends on climate, vegetation, age of rock, relief, parent rock, etc. Look at the map of India. We see six different colors indicating different types of soils found in different parts of the country. Alluvial soil is the most fertile soil. It is found in the northern plains and coastal areas of India. It is brought down by the rivers and deposited in the lower cores. Wheat, rice, sugarcane, jute and cotton grow well in this alluvial soil. It is made up of lava and has got its name because of its color. It is rich in iron. It is found in Gujarat, Maharashtra and Madhya Pradesh. Cotton grows well in black soil. It is also called cotton soil or regar soil. It can retain moisture but cracks appear when it is dry. Red soil is comparatively less fertile. It is red in color due to the presence of red oxides. It is mainly found in Tamil Nadu and Karnataka. The main crops grown in red soil are groundnut, jowar, bajra and ragi. Late white soil is found in the areas or regions where there is heavy rainfall following a dry period. Late white soils are found in the western region of the western Ghats. Do you know? The western Ghat region receives more than 300 cm of rainfall annually. This type of soil is found in the mountainous states of India like Jammu and Kashmir, Himachal Pradesh, Uttarakhand, Sikkim and Arunachal Pradesh. The mountain soil is very rich in humus. Tea, coffee and fruits like apples, peaches and plums are grown in these areas. The desert soil is sandy and dry and is found mainly in the desert regions of Rajasthan, Gujarat and some parts of Haryana. Millets, barley and maize can be grown well here. Soil is an important natural resource. Plants which are the basic need of life grow in the soil and maintain a balance in the natural surrounding which make life possible. If soil is not fit for plants to grow, then the earth will be a vast desert. So we must take care of the soil. Formation of an inch thick soil takes hundreds of years but soil erosion is a quick process. Fertile soil can be washed away by fast flowing waters or wind in no time. Thus, this process of removal of the top soil by various agents like rain, wind etc. is called soil erosion. Amazing fact! Soil is a natural water filter for underground water, filtering all pollutants. Now we all know that it is very important to check the upper fertile layer of the soil from being washed away. This can be done by controlling floods and planting trees. These are some of the ways for conserving the soil. Practice no-till farming. Constructing dams on rivers. Build terraces on hill slopes. Extensive use of chemical fertilizers and pesticides or insecticides should be controlled. Using the right methods of fluffing fields. Avoid overgrazing and plant more trees. If these methods are adopted, soil erosion can be controlled to some extent. Let us summarize. Soil is a gift of nature to man. Formation of soil depends on climate, relief, parent rock, vegetation, etc. The top layer of our earth is called soil. There are six main types of soil. Alluvial, red, black, mountain, laterite and desert soil. Alluvial soil is the most important and the most fertile soil. Black soil is also known as cotton soil, 
or regular soil. Laterite soil is found in the areas of heavy rains following a dry period. It is our duty to conserve or protect soil from being washed away. No-till farming means to avoid tilling the soil to grow crops.